Mmm. Today we're making potato chips, and at the end we're gonna see which one is better, store bought or homemade. The reason we're making these is because we just got a brand new mandolin. Ow! I'm joking. These are cut proof. Did you give them a good scrub. It's soap? <laughs> no, man. Clean them well, not too well. Don't use soap. Yeah, we'll use the holder. Safer that way. Okay. On our mandolin, there's these settings, and you can get them thinner or thicker. It's at one millimeter right now. For extra safety, we're gonna be using the holder and the cut proof gloves. It's so much easier than like trying to cut them. They're see through. One more, this one more. Fun. You use it for lots of stuff. Especially fries. Oh, fries! The reason we want to give them an ice bath is to get all the starch out. We've been there for like 10. 15. 15? Okay. Uh, I forgot to put on my apron, so I'm going to put it on now. I'll help out too. Let me dry them off. We're going to deep fry some, and we're going to microwave some. Little man's going to help me out with this, but I'll do most of the frying. This is just the bubble. Where is it? <laughs> we're going to fry them for about seven minutes or so, or until they're golden brown. Take these out when they're done, and then we're going to immediately salt them. For the microwave version, we're gonna salt these. Microwave for six minutes, flipping halfway. We're gonna blindfold little man and see if he can figure out which one's which. Okay, so you got three chips in front of you. Yep. Okay. This one? Yeah, no, that one. Okay. Number number one. No, number two was the worst. Number three was the best. I'm gonna say. Actually, no. I would have to say number one is the worst. Number one is the Lay's. Number two is the microwave. Number three is deep fried. Guess what? What? Guess what your favorite one was? What? The microwave. So if you're gonna make them at home, the deep fried ones are great, but for people that are watching calories, the microwave version. Looks so good. Super crispy, delicious, no oil. Recipes below.